Hello, random help here. I got a Samsung Galaxy S3, um, so I will show you now a review of it. So, here you go. Before opening the box, it does say it has a lot of good features. Um, yeah, quite a lot of things on networks, um, you guys can think about that. So, it goes up to 21 megabits per second. Um, it does use Edge and GPRS and quad band uh, up to 1900 megahertz. It's quad core 1.4 gigahertz and is really nice. Uh, full HD 1080 playback recording. Yep, it does do that and I have, and it's great. Uh, it does have an 8 megapixel front camera and uh, 1.9 megapixel front camera. Off. It's 4.8 inches and it's really great in the hand. It's not too big, not too small, so it's great. So that's just the box itself and I'll just go ahead and open it up. Hello people and today I'm going to be reviewing the Samsung Galaxy S3. Now here's the box that I've shown and I've just taken out some of the pieces. So you have the USB 2.0 port, um, yep that's 2.0, and the micro USB, uh, a standard for most Android phones. This one, it's a kind of a nifty kind of one because you get them open this thing up. I think you can put other extensions in for the plug, but um, that's that. So you can let me just slide that back in. That fits snug there. Also, you get extra ear pieces and buds, so that is quite cool. That's really nice. Um, here's the battery, indeed. The battery does uh, is separated from the actual thing. Let's just look at the back of the thing. So you have this 8 megapixel camera, a 1.9 megapixel front uh, front camera. Um, you have an LED flash as standard. Um, the speaker's there. There is a speaker there, but some sound mostly comes out there. I'm kind of disappointed that this won't be stereo sound, but nonetheless, it's a better smartphone from before, which is the Galaxy Ace. Mem so the memory, um, the micro SD. And yep, that's pretty much it. That's for the back, and that's how the back looks. And you get this. Uh, so this, I just got the white one. So that's just the normal back. Um, so I will. Oh yeah, and you get your. Um, as a, I'll try and say before, you get your ear, uh, earbuds as well, and just the normal user guide and stuff that I might read or might not read, and stuff like that. So that's that. Nice little box. And then everything seems to look nice and I only got this for 140 pounds from Carphone Warehouse so you could uh, check them out if you want to upgrade so it's pretty cheap and it's pretty good and it's a uh, because of the extendable micro SD card um, that's why I bought this instead of the Moto G so if you want to buy a phone I'll put, and this is 16 gigabytes um, internal memory already so that's really good so that's that so I'll just charge it up and then I'll show you around. So as I showed you the cameras before, um, I forgot to mention it has the audio jack um, as standard. The here is the power button, which is quite nice because it's such a big phone. Um, I like the size of it. Uh, you can easily and nice ease and easily switch the volume as well. So that's quite nice. Uh, but nonetheless, it looks really nice um, nice home buttons and there will be the back button and the normal Samsung buttons so now we have the actual phone up and running I want to show it to you uh, so when you uh, let's close the phone up right so when you open the phone that's the power button anyway just swipe and it will unlock swipe and unlock uh, I have been using it for a uh, poor day, it hasn't, doesn't seem that it's really uh, battery heavy in that sense, um, so that's great, uh, uh, th there's a lot of bloatware I'd say, um, uh, I'm not sure if this works, but you should be able to get Google now, uh, yeah sorry, you get S voice instead, another version of Google Voice, but from Samsung themselves, which is it's a pretty nice feature, but it's kind of slower than the Google Voice one. Um, but everything else, the apps and everything works perfectly. The camera is quite nice to to video and things. And in all in all, it's a great phone, and I would use it as a daily driver. But I would say put some kind of protection on, like some kind of casing. This does seem like when you feel it, it doesn't it feels a bit. It feels really light. It's, that's a great thing, but in that sense, it does feel like it could break. Like if you just drop it, it might break. That's how it feels like. Uh, so I will get a case for it, and I will do the review for the case as well. So that's this uh, for the Samsung Galaxy S3 review. 
um i hope you liked it uh if you want to know any more information please put a comment down below and that's it random help over and out